Mm -hmm. Hi, welcome to Laura's View and Tara too. I'm really glad you're here. Truly, I am. I hope you're glad you're here too. <laughs> Today's date is Sunday, April 30th, 2023. And this is going to be probably not a long video because I don't have data and sites for you to look at. I want to talk about a situation in our current world and see what the universe has to say about it. Here's what I'm talking about. I'm noticing more and more people are claiming that they're discouraged patriots or white hats. They're wondering if the Alliance and white hats are, are real. Now, I understand people, those people that um, voice those opinions, some people are paid to do that. They're trolls. They've been paid to act like they're discouraged to get us to think, well, yeah, I'm a little discouraged too. Oh, well, no, I'm a lot discouraged. So, but I think there's been enough people that have either been influenced by that or truly are voicing some genuine concern that it might be good to do a quick read and see, let's just ask the universe about the Alliance and White Hats. The, uh, and I want to phrase this very carefully. So the White Hats and Alliance that are talked about in this plane of existence at this current time that are opposing evil across country lines. Um, can we please have a status check, insights and updates about them, including their basic existence? So that should cover it. We'll find out, are they still on the job? Were they ever on the job? What's going on with them? Let's find out. Okay. The Alliance and White Hats. Existence, status, insights, and information. For this plane of existence and this timeline. Okay, our first card, Page of Wands. One of my white hat cards, the lovers, two of pentacles, knight of cups, the tower, nine of wands, and the two of swords. Okay, what is this telling us? Okay, our question, first of all, we were asking for Confirmation of the existence, and then insights, information, and updates. Yes, there are white hats, absolutely, okay? All right, and they are still very much working in our behalf, okay? No doubt about it. Now, the recent past, we have the Two of Pentacles. So there have been some that have chosen to fall away, just like there have been some people that have been following the 17 movement and things like that, that have chosen to fall away, okay? But not too many, okay? And unfortunately, some of those that stayed, stayed to um, cause some disruption, some issues, what have you. Let's look at the near future. We are coming up on our tower event that is really gonna be world changing, okay? It's showing up now in our near future. Now remember, if you've been following me for a while, when we were getting close to the London Bridge event, this tower card showed up more and more often in political reads and, and it moved from here, it, it moved from <laughs> near future to present, okay? So we are coming closer to a sky event, a big event that's going to be changing our world a lot and it's showing up now in our near future. Now, there've been people that have been really struggling to help that happen. We've had people that have uh, put their lives on the line, their livelihoods, their reputations, what have you on the line, still determined and stalwart. So if you think that this uh, movement of White Hats and Alliance has faded, it is, it's had some blows, it's had some uh, attrition, but very much still determined, okay? And this is a card, not 
quite as important as this one, showing that we are in a period where we are going to have to do a little bit of waiting for this event to happen. But it's now showing up in our near future, not in the far off or not even not on here. The white hats are very much a part of our life and the alliance. Now understand too, that in my lens, the alliance includes um, divine as well as benevolent off-world help. And I've gotten nothing in any of my reads to indicate differently. I'm sad that a few of the white hats weren't truly white hats. They've kind of been weeded out and sorted out and uh, um, the wheat and the chaff has been dealt with, apparently. Let's get a couple more cards and see what's going on with our white hats. Okay, tower moment is going to involve number 46, probably his departure. And we're going to, and the uh, financial changes will happen after that happens. Okay, <clears throat> once that does, we're going to have a lot of change for the better happening very, very fast for our lives and our world. <laughs> And the Wheel of Fortune is always turning. And since our world is going from dark to light, this is a fabulous card to just say, hey, we've got to get through this scare event, this tower moment, whatever this is, okay? But there's going to be definitely good things happening for our world in general, um, our finances, what have you. So let's re recap really quickly because I have some little three-year-olds coming over. <laughs> Yes, Virginia, there is a Santa Claus. Yes, Virginia, there are white hats. And they can be as simple as people like me who offer my content at no subscription fee to actually boots on the ground, wearing a uniform, wielding weapons, people that have gone underground and beyond to bring our world to the place it should be. So just because things don't move at the speed you want doesn't mean they're not happening. And the cards have reassured us that not only is there White Hats and Alliance and that they're strong and uh, they've had some cleans cleansing of their ranks, okay? But in the near future, we are coming up on a tower moment. And when we do, we're gonna have some really fabulous things happening. I have no doubt about it. I hope you don't either, okay? It's hard to wait. It's like waiting for Christmas morning, okay? But, uh, our world is worth it and our little ones are worth it. So I'm in it to win it as long as it takes. I'd like it to be today, but however long it takes, I'm okay with it. What's the alternative? Bowing to evil and permanent enslavement? Hell no, not me. That's it for this video. Um, I'd love a little feedback from you. If you were able to hear me better, uh, please let me know in the comments below. This is my first uh, video that I'm doing with my new computer. And I have gone ahead and assuming that there won't be a complete fix of the audio issues we've had, I have ordered myself a uh, wired microphone to start wearing. So if you're still having a little trouble hearing me, please be patient. Um, I'm getting the equipment in to fix that as much as possible. And in the meantime, thank you as always for your time and attention. It's precious, your time and your attention. I don't uh, take it for granted. And so until next time, love and light.